It's an interview that will shake a nation already reeling from this horrific crime, with the details painting the authorities in a harsh light. They were tricked on board the bus, he says, even paying a 30 cents fare. And then the nightmare began. They started teasing my friend and it led to a brawl. One brought an iron rod and hit me, he says, before I fell unconscious. They took my friend away. For over an hour, the bus cruised round Delhi, seen here in CCTV footage, with the men brutally torturing and raping the woman. After throwing them off without their clothes, the driver tried to mow them down. I saved my friend by pulling her away, he says, in the nick of time. Yet for nearly 30 critical minutes, with his friend bleeding profusely, no one stopped to help. Even at the hospital, we were made to wait, and I had to literally beg for clothes, he says. He calls their attackers animals and says he wishes he could have saved her. Talking about the protests that have followed, he says her death has awakened India. Carrying on this fight, he says, will be her tribute. Andrew North, BBC News.